welcome back to Messy and Beautiful with Sarah Jane. Um, it's lovely to have you here today. Now I'm going to be doing another haul video. Um, I know that I said I would be doing no by July but I failed miserably. I think that what I'll be better off doing is trying to set myself a budget rather than trying to cut spending out completely because um, there's so many beautiful products out there that I just can't resist um, and I'm a real sucker for stickers. And at the minute, I'm a real sucker for a grab bag. So I thought I would share with you um, some things that I ordered recently. Now, there's also something very special coming up, a sneak peek for Wendy's Cute Creations. Um, it actually opens on the 1st of August. Wendy's given me permission to include her um, designs in this video. Um, so I did just want to you know, show you a little sneak preview of some of the things that will be available um, but I'll come on to that shortly so I'm just going to move that one out of the way for the moment now the first things that I've bought are all from Little Pencil Designs um, if you haven't heard of Little Pencil Designs then I'll link the Etsy shop down below um, she also has a YouTube channel where she shows like a day in the life vlogs and that sort of thing um, which are really interesting to watch so I'll share that link as well and hopefully you can head over to that channel if you're interested um, I'm sure that if you've watched my last haul video from Etsy that you'll see that I fell in love with Flump um, and Flump had a birthday recently so I went on and I had a look at what there was um, they were doing a special offer and I got a little bit carried away to say the least um, so I've got a couple of things here um, I say a couple there I think there's quite a lot in these bags but I'll, I'll take you through them um, and we can have a look together I haven't opened them yet um, the first thing that I got I'm going to take it out of the plastic wrapping I haven't been through any of this yet yet it's been sitting on the side for the last 24 hours um, and I'm absolutely desperate to get stuck in but I thought I would do it on camera um, so the first thing that I got was a cute happy planner cover um, with like the Japanese bloom flowers it says time to bloom on the front and then the flump in the corner and then the inside I just think is absolutely gorgeous I just love the flowers I love that it's covered in flumps I thought that it would be something nice to spruce up my planner a little bit um, I do get bored of my planners quite quickly I tend to buy more so I thought rather than buying a whole new planner I would just treat myself to a cover um, the shop actually does them in different sizes as well so you can get them for you know the mini happy planner you can get them um, for the micro I believe as well but I treat myself to a classic because that's the size that I mostly use um, so that's the first thing I got and then I got two other bags of goodies um, so in the first one is oh quite a lot actually um, I'm going to show you this first because I couldn't resist we all know I'm a sucker for a cup of tea so just my cup of tea it's a little coaster to go on my desk and funnily enough the day that this arrived my husband made a joke to me about how I needed another coaster for my desk because I've always got a cup of tea and something else on the go so I pulled this out and showed it to him and he just laughed at me because he was like trust you to find something um, when I'm going to buy you a present and I was just like well you know already got it so um, yeah so that really made us laugh but I just love it because Flump's hugging a little tea bag I just think it's so cute um, and then there's all sorts of goodies in here um, some of this is from Flump's birthday party um, as I said earlier Flump had a birthday recently so I ordered one of the birthday bags um, and you get an awful lot of stuff now I can't remember what is just a birthday bag and if I ordered anything separately or not um, I probably should have looked at that up before I started filming but the first thing is a couple of little pin badges Flump celebrating his birthday these little ones there um, I know exactly where I'm going to put these and there'll be a video about it shortly um, so you'll be able to see what I do with um, little pin badges and then there's some washi tape um, just some cute different designs here that one's rose gold and coming on a Pokemon card um, it's a bit of a throwback to my youth so that's actually really made me smile because I used to collect these when I was like much much younger um, and then this is Sparkle Princess Co. So I think this is actually a different shop. Um, but it's a little planner charm. It's got a little handbag. I think that's really cute. Lovely pretty pink flower and lots of little diamante type pieces. Um, I might have to check that shop out as well if it's a separate shop entirely. Um, but back to Flump. I'll just put that to one side rather than putting it away. Got a little Flump paper clip. 
holding an envelope. I won't open all of these, we'll be here all day. Um, but it's a little felty paper clip. I just think he's so cute, he's got such a little happy face. It just makes me smile. Um, and then in here, bounce into the week and life's a party. These look like they might be cards. Um, with some envelopes, so let's have a little look. So that one says bounce into the week, yeah, just little blank gift cards. They're really cute. I'm sure I've got a couple of friends who would really appreciate those. And then in this one, just get the packages open. Sorry, it's taken me a little bit longer because it's all parceled up so neatly. Um, everything's really well protected, which is nice. It's nice to receive a delivery where everything is really well looked after. Um, this must be some of Flump's birthday bag because I see that there's a little Flump holding a balloon and it's got like a shimmery effect on the front. It's really cute. Flump with his birthday cake and then Flump baking. I love that one. It's so cute. I do like a bit of baking myself. And then just some little stay at home samplers. So all the things that we're doing at home at the minute, definitely cleaning, definitely reading. That's my husband in working in the garden. And then this is birthday flump washi. So it's little tiny strips of washi and um, really cute. And then some box stickers. Um, and then along the side, you've got today is the day celebrate time to party. And then a couple more celebrate ones. Um, I really like this top secret. So very cute. Could have done with that last week actually because my sister-in-law had a baby shower and it was top secret so um but never mind i'm sure there'll be something else that will be a surprise and this is absolutely gorgeous lovely silver foil on there and it's got lots of little flumps um bouncy castle a present flump opening all his gifts nice little one with a balloon there and then it says meals remember next week priority this week and to do and there's even some little dot stickers down here which i think will be really helpful for checklists um, and then some washi strips down the side and some more checklist boxes. Um, they're actually mostly box stickers as well, little boxes here and longer ones. Um, I'm not sure what planner this is designed for. It might be a Hobo Weeks kit because it does look similar to that, but I'm sure that I will make it work in my planner. And then in here, so many things in one parcel. I'm so excited to get this through the door and I can't believe I've waited a whole 24 hours to open it because um, normally I rip things open the minute they arrive but I thought it'd be nice to open it on camera and flump holding a little happy mail definitely my happy day um, I got myself a scratch card which is lovely um, and then little sampler flump sitting under an umbrella love his groovy little outfit there reminds me of like shell suits from when you were kids the 80s and then another one there that's already punched as well which is quite nice so that'll fit nicely in a in a any happy planner um, or an arc planner probably as well I think the stems on the happy planner are slightly longer but it'll probably fit in an arc planner too and then there's a little washi sample um actually I looked at buying some back washi earlier so the fact that I've now got some saves me buying a whole roll so that's lovely nice little note there that you normally get from little pencil designs and then this must be some sort of grab bag I've bought I imagine um oh wow so, oh, I bought a Christmas countdown because um, everyone's raving about Christmas in July. I don't know if Christmas stickers will be available again later in the year, and I'm hoping that they will. Um, but while they had these cute little flumps with the countdown, I thought they'd be nice to go in my planner every day in December. Um, and then another one with all the little flump characters um, snuggle down, go for a walk, declutter. I'm doing lots of that at the minute like candles, manicure, it's all sort of self care -y type things, um, which is lovely. And then there's some kits, so some boxes along the top here, weekend. I like that it's bright red, it's quite nice to see something that's a bit more vibrant. I don't tend to use red generally. Um, I came, I saw, I bought it all, that sounds like me, doesn't it? If you can't find me, I'm probably at Target. Not sadly something for me in this country but I can always put a sticker over the top and change the name somewhere um, yeah and then this one is really up my street so this is like a wintry kit um, kind of festive 
it's blues and greens and I love blues and greens um, little to-do list there with Flump in the corner look Flump looking all happy in his little snow onesie so cute hot cocoa like a hug from inside that's cute it's penguining to look a lot like winter I love that that's so cute a little snowflake checklists oh wow this is adorable the snuggle is real <laughs> Oh, I've got a really rubbish sense of humour. Um, and then some box stickers, and they've got like checklist dots down the side, and then you get some more of the little flumps and the little onesies. I love this. It reminds me of my, my daughter when she was newborn, and we used to put her in a great big snowsuit, and she'd look like Maggie from The Simpsons. It's so cute. Um, but yeah, so that's that one. And then in here, oops, try not to rip the sticker. And then in this one, is just a little um, grab bag of samplers by the looks of things so some self-care work from home this is planning lids um oh darling stationery they look quite similar to plump planner stickers um with the color palette it, a plump planner tend to do more pastel sort of colors as far as i've seen anyway i'm sure that might not be true for all of them um but that's quite similar to that and then little pity paper <laughs> oops i bought things um definitely me little elves christmas in july elves with a surfboard brilliant birth sea crafts this is a pink planner sale that i've taken part in apparently according to that um i think they were doing a special where if you spent over a certain amount you got the scratch card now i remember um which is how i've ended up with that um didn't cry i need that one this week Coffee holic, coffee addict, coffee is my best friend. Um, that's chick blossom prints, and then little planet. This is really cute. I like this. And the little guy with the moon shaped cloud, so cute. Josephine Bow Designs. Her stuff is gorgeous. I don't own any of it yet, but it's really really pretty. Bella Planella. Um, I ordered another round from Bella Planella as well because of their Christmas in July and their Christmas releases. I just couldn't resist. I think her designs are just gorgeous. Um, this is Ambitious Mimi. And their Indie Nivy Ink. These are quite cute. They're really detailed as well. Even like the tie-dye t-shirt, it's got loads of little white lines in it. You might not be able to see it, but the washi tape's covered in dots. That's my sort of washi tape as well. It's a bit similar to my logo. And then paper sticks that's cute bow liner brilliant so that's a little grab bag there um so that's everything i got from little pencil designs and as i say go and check out their shop because i've got loads and loads of stuff you don't have to buy all the flumps um there are other bits and pieces too but i am absolutely in love with flump because he's so cute or she might be she i just assume he's a boy um, so that's all of that stuff and then this is from Wendy's cute creations um, Wendy held a competition on her Facebook group to name some characters of her new designs um, her shop opens on Saturday I'll link down to the Facebook group below because if you join the Facebook group then she's doing a special offer um, but you have to be a member of that Facebook group to get that offer so go over and join the Facebook group um, and then you can have a little sneak peek at the stickers here and then once you've seen them and you decide what you want to go buy you can go and use that discount code um, but i will link that down below so that you can go and check that out um, she's doing a countdown as well i know wendy's really excited to share everything now she has said in her note to me that these are oops stickers um, she's written oops on the back and that's absolutely fine with me i love an oops bag anyway um so they might be they're likely to be better quality than what i'm getting um but considering the quality of them anyway i can't really complain so it looks as though she's changed the name of the shop so these ones have a different banner at the top um but the competition was to name the characters so i actually won two i got to name two of these characters which i think is wonderful um, and I've got the names of all of them for you, so you can have a look. I'm just trying to get the bit of paper off of here. I don't like waste. I'll probably use that for something. That's why I don't just tear them off. Um, I'm just that sort of person. Um, so we'll start with these ones, because these look like they're on slightly older paper. Um, but I absolutely love this sheet. Look at it. Little happy mail. This is Albert the Husky. 
Uh, so she's done a little husky character and he's got this happy mail, he's got his paw prints on the envelope. Um, I love him sitting in the box, even with the man on his head, I just think it's so cute. Um, and then, oh, these might be the same actually, now I look at them. Yeah, okay, so we've got two lots of the same. So what I'm gonna do is I am just going to put them together, oh, similar, not all of them are the same. So then this one is Paulie the pig. I actually named Paulie, it's one of the names I came up with. Um, and Paulie's there in his little chef's hat with his little utensils, very cute. Aprons, oven gloves and a piping bag. Paulie eating some food and then the oven's there and then this is Olivia the octopus um, I'm sorry I don't know who named Albert and Olivia um, and I should have probably mentioned you as well for being competition winners but I hope you're enjoying your stickers that Wendy sent to you I assume she sent the same things to you as well um, but that's Olivia doing a workout there I love the little skipping rope around the octopus brilliant and then this is Miko the monkey um, Miko is the other one that I named Miko doing his food shopping there and I've got two sheets of those and then we're back to Paulie with some little budget stickers I think these are adorable I love Paulie with all the money um, that is going to be me throwing money at sticker shops because that's what I do um, I am going to try and stop but the perfect timing for me and then there's another one there of Olivia doing her little workout um, so they're the little sneak peeks of some of the things that you're going to be able to get from Wendy's cute creations. Um, I think she's done a fantastic job at designing these characters and they're really, really up my street. As you could probably tell by me liking Flump, um, kawaii designs are my sort of thing. Little cartoon characters, cutesy things. Um, so I'm really, really impressed with them. And thank you so much, Wendy, for sending these to me and for picking two of my character names because I'm really proud of myself for coming up with something that you actually liked. Um, and it's really wonderful for you to have sent them to me. And I'm glad that you could all join me today. And um, thank you very much for watching. Don't forget to enter my giveaway on my last video if you haven't already. It closes on Sunday um, if you haven't done already because I've got some freebies to give away as well. And I just want to say thank you very much for joining me again today. And it's been lovely to have you here. Take care. Bye.